So anyway, um, this is a strange um, racing rear end. I had them, uh, when I ordered this rear end from Strange, I had them weld the um, stock Chevy 2 uh, perches on them, which you see welded to the rear. The U-bolts are um, from PTO Sales. Um, PTO Sales deals with them like big trucks like Kenworth, Peterbilt. They have contracts with them. So they make a really good U-bolt. These are half inch, I think 20s. Um, they're about, I think these are seven and a half. I picked those up the other day. So it's PTO Sales. The only other place I know that sells a really good U-bolt uh, is um, uh, Jegs. So I've never seen them at Summit. But so anyway, um, yeah, if you get a rear end, make sure they weld the, the factory stock perches on it uh, for a Chevy too. Um, don't uh, let them don't don't let them put one of them Chrysler ones on it. Or they call them a universal one because those suck. Um, the only thing with those is I think they do have a locating pinhole in them. But um, it does push the car down. Well, maybe not because... Anyway, I've, I've had both. <laughs> Just make sure you get the, uh, the Chevy 2 um, perch, factory perch installed. So anyway, these are the cheesy lowering blocks. Um, it's basically, there's nothing on the top that holds it in, nothing on the bottom that holds it in. Um, you see the huge gap um, in the perch um, in relationship to the, uh, uh, the block, the lowering block. <clears throat> you see the huge gap at the spring <laughs> um, in relationship to uh, the way this lowering block design is. So. Now that's why we use um, a perch, a modified perch, that's going to fit in here. And then now it's going to be real nice um, on the spring. So, it's actually, Chevy 2 made a real nice design on that. You know, so we wanted to keep that part where it holds the spring um, steady. Okay, so we got one out. Now, uh, as you can see, um, Again, this being the factory perch, um, normally this this part right here fits real nice on the leaf spring. That's why ours uses a modified uh, perch. So we are going to run the rubber. Our rubber is good. I just changed it last year. So um, we're going to run both the rubbers, the top and the bottom. Okay, so I just put... Um, the uh, modified perch on. Again, we're still using the existing perch. Here's our modified. Look how nice that fits <laughs> around the uh, around the uh, leaf spring. It's because it's factory. That perch is a factory size. I mean, it's made to do that. So that's why we uh, used the perch. We incorporated a factory perch in our design. So now our blocks are going to go right here on each side. So. Let me do that.